All right, so I've got the whole body glazed. The front done. Everything looks pretty good. Got the side done over here. So now I've got the drawer. And um, I'm just going to do this one handed. I'll do one drawer just to give you an idea of what to do. It's pretty much the same as um, doing everything else. Just brush it on and do it with the rub it with the the grain. Now this it's got these little lips right here, so you want to make sure that you get everything out of there. Um, I'm not wearing gloves because a lot of this is is done with the, with you facing downward and it's so hot uh, my gloves were like full of sweat it was gross so if you get sweat on this because um, <laughs> it might happen I guess if you're doing it outside if you get sweat on this while you're wiping it off you're done it, it jacks it up um, I can't remember if you can go back and re-wet it with wood stain and do it again or not, but I remember it messes it up. Okay, so same thing with everything else. Um, I'm pretty much going to start with the top. It's got paint on the top here. Just get it blended in. And then it's kind of like two parts to this drawer. So I'm going to do this one part right here. And then I'm going to do this part right here. So that's the initial wipe. And you just come back and clean everything up. Making sure I get all this out of here so it doesn't bleed a whole bunch and look tacky. It looks tacky to me at least. I don't like it. Let's kind of blend all that there. So that's done. The drawers. Let me get this drawer in here. The drawers are a, are a pretty big challenge because you have to make sure that you get the color tone even. So, once you go to do more drawers, basically you need to make sure that you rub off the same amount of stain. Like you can see already where I put it in. The tone is different. This is this is darker right here, so I can come and rub it. Make it lighter and make it match. See that? It's like a perfect match. So again, like I said, drawers, drawers are a real big challenge just because you need to make sure you wipe off enough of this uh, stain as you did on the other one so they all match. If one it's too dark and you don't notice until a couple hours later and the glaze is, the stain is all dry, just put more stain on it and re-wipe it and match, match your other one. So I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of the drawers and then um, I'll show you the results and uh, get to the polyurethane part and that will be pretty much done.